A lot of people say that I invented experiential marketing. And I called it livertizing. I take the ad, I bring it to the people, I bring it to life with human touch. The whole idea of the walk with Carrie Load is, is to talk to people. Hey guys, good to see you again. Yeah, for the firehouse, there's a little donation from us. Thank you. Oh my God, thank you, thank you, thank you. Here you go. I'll give this, Debbie. It's the ministry you're hanging out. All right, welcome very much. Keep this thing going, all right? Who are you carrying? Good job, guys. These people that come out, they've lost somebody. Or they know somebody that it's, it's they're one degree of separation of somebody either lost, dead, or crippled, or missing. It's emotional. I can't tell you how many times I've walked with people and absolutely cried my heart out. Dill was the person who had the idea and championed this national effort. I'm carrying the load, I'm carrying rescue five. That's what I'm doing, what are you doing? Dill said, we can do this. We can create a relay, it can be national, got everybody real excited about what he might be able to do with his engagement skills, with his marketing skills, with his relationships to basically make something really fantastic from a national branding point of view. And every year we hit the marks on time, on budget. Okay? Okay. And we got the and we gotta go. go. You can trace back the entire history of the world, movements, no movement ever started without the human touch. Until I met Susan and until I went down to Georgia, I thought he was full of shit most of the time. And here he comes, Bubba Clinton. I like <laughs> He's one of the most giving, heartfelt people I've ever met. I thought that these stories were kind of being stretched a little. If I called Greeny right now and said, Greeny, I need half a million dollars, I guarantee you it would be, what do they call it now, VIN mode? Until I walked into his office in Georgia, and it looks like a museum. I mean, his creative ideas are absolutely amazing. And how my brain works is I got to draw the map. <laughs> Too deep on that. Phenomenal leader, phenomenal visionary. Yeah. He's kind of magic and madness all in one. He has no filters. Dill's gonna be naked, not naked, but boxer, yeah, like at the beach, it's grease, man, you know, come on. But that comes from his thing about believing and being totally honest. Maybe there is a beast. It's probably about me, huh? it's me, I'm the beast. <laughs> Coach, mentor, encourager, just a very unique, special man. Don't tell me those are, no, I gotta, I gotta go, I gotta go. You gotta do the camera, let's get out. That, you know, I'm proud to call a friend. But I like to think, though, the legacy would be, you know, a pretty good guy that really believed in the ministry of hanging out and believed in leaving every project, leaving a piece of me there. Positive human energy, that's what it's all about.